Welcome to the New Song Cafe here at WorshipTogether.com. Today we're here with Jordan Fry from Urban Rescue sharing Song of My Father. So sit back and enjoy this New Song Cafe. Jordan, it's great to be with you. Thanks for coming by. Great to be here. And uh, Nolan, good to see you. Thanks for uh, spending the time with us. Man, we're so excited about these new songs. And, Thank you. Um, just a lot of content. I think a thing when I started listening through what you guys had done, it's just like how much scripture had influenced. Yeah. Uh, what you guys were writing and really taking uh, really great passages of scripture, putting them to music so that the church can sing it in a fresh way is, yeah. what, um, is what I heard. But this is definitely one of those songs, a uh, song called Song of My Father. Yeah. Talk about this because I know this was, you kind of took some scripture on this and kind of wrote on that theme. Yeah, um, and I just have to read it um, because it's one of the coolest verses in the Bible and I'm going to read it out of the message and it's from Zephaniah 317. Um, Jerusalem will be told, do not be afraid. Dear Zion, don't despair. Your God is present among you, a strong warrior there to save you. Happy to have your back. He'll calm you with his love and delight you with his songs. Mm -hmm. And in the NIV, um, it says, I will rejoice over you with singing. Mm, wow. And we were talking about it last night we sing so many songs and we, we write so many songs to God. Um, but I wonder if there's a space in our services. Um, I, I, I just think it's hard to receive God's love sometimes. It's hard to, to, to imagine God singing over us. Um, but he does. And I, if I really think about it, like how incredible is that song? What what does the voice of God sound like? Um, and so this is really a song about that moment where it's it's the middle of the night. You look up to the sky and you just hear the song of your father. Mm -hmm. And um, we we tried to um, just capture that as best we could. Yeah, and that really is a great part of, of kind of the theology of why we sing. Yeah. You know, you, if you, you know, as you're talking to your church and helping people understand what worship is, I think sometimes we think worship was sort of like our idea, or like singing <laughs> was our idea, you know? Um, but when you read scripture like that, you recognize it's like, you know, we, we sing to a singing mm. God, you know? And it really opens up a, kind of a breadth of the theology of worship of that we're really trading songs back and forth to each other, you know, wow. kind of thing. So it's, it's really a beautiful concept. Uh, will you guys play through it? I'd love for everybody to hear it. Yeah.
Wow, it's so great. And, and you know, as you were singing and also from the scripture, I just realized, you know, just kind of in the, the place the church is in right now and, and in our world, there's a lot of fear and there's a lot of uncertainty and that sort of thing. And, mm. and what a great song to be able to sing mm. in church to say that, you know, in the midst of all that, we know God that you're, yeah. you're in control and that, you know, you are yeah. over us, you're singing over us. And that, so well, that's, it's, what a great timing mm. you know, for the song. And I think you're in the key of D, is that right? Yeah, um, again, half step down, um, and I'm just kind of pedaling. I'm playing in D, and I'm just pedaling on these open chords again. D, um, A, B minor, G. Simple as that. That's the verse, and then um, chorus is a little bit different. We'll go um, in the middle of the night, back on the one. Then I do the D over F sharp minor. I look up to the sky. I can hear you singing over me. B minor, G. Uh, through the fire and the flood, I know, I know that I am loved. I can hear you singing over me. Um, and um, for the bridge, it's... Um, I think it is it the same chords for the bridge too. I think it's the same chords for the bridge, Jimmy. We didn't really. We, <laughs> the same pattern the whole way through. There's just a couple. There's a couple substitutions. What we're saying so is you didn't break any new ground, <laughs> chord-wise, right? It's diatonic. Like, it's what, what was that word you just used? Diatonic. I don't know what that means, but that's also why I brought Nolan today. Um, this is diatonic. <laughs> And to me, I'm just playing the same four chords, I believe, the whole song. The whole song, right? Yeah. Really simple. D, A, B minor, G. Yeah. Man, what a great lyric uh, and a great song, guys. Thanks so much for coming by. Thank you. In the middle of the night, I look up to